What's up, what's going on, what's good? This your boy Dwayne, bring y'all another video in. So today, I'm gonna be showing y'all how to vlog with a subpar $900 camera with a 24 to 105 F4 to 7.1 lens, a Rode video mic go, and yeah, it got a flippy screen. <laughs> Let's get into it. Oh, um, if y'all didn't get that, that was a, I'm pulling a Maddie, a Poe. Okay, let's go vlog with the camera. So you want to vlog, but you don't know where to start, right? I recommend this. Like I said at the beginning of the video, this is the Canon EOS RP. This is a sub $900 camera. Depending on where you get it, you can get it used for like $700, $750. Depending on who's selling it, depending on where you get it from. You know what I'm saying? And I like this little camera a lot. You can vlog with it. This camera I use to vlog on my family channel. Again, I got a Rode Video Mic Go on here. It has a flippy screen. You know what I'm saying? And it does everything I needed to do. If I need to vlog with it, it already has an F4 aperture on it. And I can just go and throw on a 67 millimeter filter ND filter on here and you need a good microphone so here we are on the Canon RP how this look it's actually look good for a full frame sub $800 $900 camera with a $300 lens on here the battery finna die but I mean that's great regardless of the fact that this the R6 and then this the RP you know what I'm saying so so Essentially, this is all you really need, a mic, a microphone, a good enough camera. I wouldn't really say don't vlog. Depending on your situation, make sure you get like an ND filter or something for the Canon RP just because the dynamic range on it is good, but okay, it's bad, it's bad. <laughs> so just get a, a, a ND filter, you know what I'm saying? So yeah. Yeah, so. Just get a little comfortable being in front of the camera, you know what I'm saying? Practice, sit in front of the camera and practice. The image quality you get out of this little camera is good. You know what I'm saying? It ain't too bad. And this will literally run you like a thousand dollars depending on how you use it and when you get it from. You can get the road video might go for like, I don't know, $100 uh, used. You can find it on Facebook Marketplace or something like that. And then the little 24 to 105 F4 to 7.1, you can probably find that on Adoroma for like $150, $200 max, uh, probably $250. Because I think this lens costs like $400 or something like that. I don't know. I'm not too sure. And then, uh, yeah, get you a couple batteries because the battery life on this sucks. Like these batteries die, but they don't, like they die fairly quick. You know what I'm saying? So you definitely going to want to get multiple batteries for this camera like i have i want to say like six or seven batteries for this so yeah i recommend it you know what i'm saying if you're gonna i mean this little lens has image stabilization and everything so the only thing it don't have is a control ring for it to be a rf lens but i mean that's fine so with that being said guys i'm gonna go ahead and get up out don't forget to leave a like subscribe comment hit that notification bell if you learn something new and i'll catch y'all in the next one uh, peace. <laughs>